The Philharmonic and Opera is a little bit different here in Sacramento. We are this blended organization and we have an opportunity to reach a wide variety of uh, patrons and audience members um, because we have this ability to perform orchestral pop music, orchestral classical music, and then using our orchestra along with the, our opera chorus and singers, we can bring that whole blend together as well. My name is Alice Sorrow. I'm the executive director for the Sacramento Philharmonic and Opera. During the pandemic, all the arts here in Sacramento and elsewhere had to really take a look at what was happening. We were all a little bit thrown off our game because we couldn't do what we do best, which is present performances live with our audience and that was taken away and we thought well maybe we'll just wait till the summer and it will pass and things will get better but that date kept getting pushed out so in the meantime we were all working very hard to think how can we pivot and still stay connected and bring that soul uh, healing music to our patrons and to the community Right now, the SPNO is working very hard to stay further connected to our community. We are pulling together all of our musicians this month. For, we have formed groups of 10 to 20 musicians at a time, socially distanced, with masks as appropriate, so that we can rehearse some music and then go over to the Mandavi Center and record it. Uh, using today's environment where, again, people wear masks while they're playing their stringed instruments or some of the percussion. And then the winds and brass have to keep a little bit further apart. And using all the protocols for today, we've been very uh, happy to be able to have this activity so that we can bring digitally streamed performances to our community. Right now, we are looking to the future. We are looking to when we can all get safely back to the Safe Credit Union Performing Arts Center that has worked so hard to finish their renovations during this pandemic time. We believe that it will be open for us in some type of socially distanced capacity in the fall, and we are looking forward to getting back to a real season again in person with all our, our friends and colleagues and community members.